So you probably already know this, but I'll just tell you, I grew up watching a lot of PBS Kids shows because my family didn't have cable. And one of my favorites was, and still is, Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. Now, one thing that you may or may not know about Mr. Rogers is he was a music major in college and a composer. And he actually wrote all of the music that you hear on Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. I'm going to sing one of his songs right now. It's called What Do You Do With The Mad That You Feel? And it's about managing your anger, of course. Mr. Rogers actually quoted this song in a congressional hearing about PBS and its importance. Congress was considering defunding PBS that year, but after that hearing, PBS was not only defunded, it had its funding increased. So, very powerful song, very powerful person. I'm going to sing it for you now. I have changed just a couple of lyrics at the very end of the song to reflect our more modern understanding of gender. But other than that, it's the exact same song, and it really holds up today for kids and for grown-ups alike. What do you do with the mad that you feel when you feel so mad you could bite? When the whole wide world seems oh so wrong, and nothing you do seems very right. So what do you do? Do you punch a bag? Do you pound some clay or some dough? Do you round up friends for a game of tag and see how fast you go? It's good to be able to stop when you've planned a thing that's wrong and be able to do something else instead and think this song I can stop when I want to, can stop when I wish, can stop, stop, stop anytime. And what a good feeling to feel like this, and know that the feeling is really mine. Know that there's something deep inside that helps us become what we can. For a kid can be someday a grown up. Non binary woman or man.